I'm going to review Playing With Fire. This movie surprised me. I wasn't expecting this movie to uh, be any good. But I wanted to see it because my boy John Cena's in it, so. And Keegan Michael Key. But I can say this. The movie was like, in the first half of this movie, it was like they were taking the, the mick out of, uh, you know, all these f famous actors who are really good and really funny and making them, like, not funny. You know, it's like, oh, let's, let's, let's make them try so hard to be funny but fail in the process so it makes it even more unfunny. I'd be like, that's a great idea. But then the second half of this movie, I really enjoyed. Like, from since the, sec like the second half, I enjoyed it all. I enjoyed the rest of the movie, and I was like, well, that's shocking. Because you're thinking this movie was gonna be really bad. It was actually like maybe a guilty pleasure, but maybe it might be a guilty pleasure in the future. But it, you know, it was it was actually pretty um interesting and i was interested and i was i was actually i was kind of praising the movie a little bit um with the continuity like they remember stuff they didn't just forget about it they they were mentioning stuff that you probably forgot about or remembered just briefly before and uh they were still doing it you know and and i'll be honest there was a lot of uh sweet moments in this movie like, when I mean sweet, I mean like, ah, uh, uh, sweet moments like that. I don't mean like, like sweet, like, oh, boss, oh, that is amazing sweet. I mean like, you know, you know, cuddliness sweet, let's say that. Um, and I was, I was shocked. Because I was shocked that I was interested. I was shocked that I, that I actually was interested in this movie. There's a PG, I feel like John Cena, you know. He's he's great at as an at, in adult films. That's what I would say. I would say John Cena didn't deserve to be in this movie. I mean, he just didn't. I, I don't know why he wanted to be in this movie. I mean, they could have had anyone else. I mean, it's not like they put him in a movie for a specific reason. They didn't. They just they just put him in a movie. It's like oh, John Cena, a bit strange. But then oh, like he's 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 going up. The rankings in Hollywood or he's you know he's getting more popular he's getting more popular let's put him in a movie that you're probably gonna forget about or let's put him in a movie where like you'll probably remember it and go yeah playing with fire that was a thing you know what I mean other than what's it Bumblebee or Blockers or I mean that's what I mean I could mention his other movies that are actually way better than this doesn't mean this movie was terrible it just means there were there are uh, a lot of movies that are way better than this movie because th there always is going to be this was not the best movie ever but it wasn't the worst you know what i mean so it's a bit like middle meh but like meh like i enjoyed it it surprised me but there's not a lot of memorable moments and there's not a lot of moments where you can be like that was epic. No. Because um, I don't think it's meant to be like a movie like that. But movies that maybe they shock you. But like if they had like a fight scene. Made it even more interesting. You'd remember it. But they don't. But yeah. I will, I will say to you. That Playing With Fire was alright. 